Hey folks and welcome back to the channel. This upload is going to be a little bit different only because I haven't been doing a whole lot of recording the last few days since the last upload. Uh, we've been quite busy at work so I haven't really had the opportunity to grab the camera every second to you know to grab a little thing here or there. So I just wanted to be able to share with you a few things that I did pick up along the way over the last couple of days that I just you know felt the need to share and, uh, and get some content out there to you in case you were looking for that next upload. So here's what I got. Well, it's another winter slash spring day. It's Monday and we're off to work. do this. We've got ourselves here a 2012 Jeep Wrangler and it's got some LEDs in the bumper and up overhead. And these LEDs are for off-road use and what we see a lot of is people taking your average everyday car and somehow affixing LED lighting to the vehicle in an obvious fashion that does not make any sense. So for example, 05 Chevy Aveo. There's one running around town that has one bolted right to the hood. That's not cool. Here are a couple of examples of how not to use LED lighting. We got some four-wheel drive trucks to sell. 09 GMC, 08 Ranger, and a 13 F-150. Somebody tried to pull a prank on Junior, but they got caught. I'm smarter than that. Ready? Ready. Confetti, sprinkles. You just you do that just without it? It was worth the dollar, wasn't it? <laughs> Brand new exhaust if you were to go dirty. Chrome coated. Gold plated. <laughs> Oh, when the balloon was inflated, it added quite a bit, but... <laughs> the thing was just growing. I thought it was going to pop like when it was that big, but that thing got like... That you, big. You, you got halfway home before you noticed that. <laughs> big cloud of gold <laughs> glitter going behind you. <laughs> I hope that was enough to keep you entertained for a little while, at least for a few minutes. And uh, I thought that I would share just a, 
little bit of something that I've been going through the last few days as well. Without going into detail, we've been going through a little bit of stress at work. At the end of the day, we want to fix what's wrong. We want to right the wrong, so to speak. So uh, ultimately, that's what we are doing. And, you know, we hope that those that know my father and I know that we take pride in building the name, building our name in the community. So we want to thank everybody for keeping with us. And like I said, we will get through this. I really appreciate, I say this every time, but I really appreciate everybody who takes the time to watch these videos and uh, so that you get to understand a little bit about the ins and outs of the, uh, the car business and, and sometimes a little bit about what, uh, you know, what I'm about and what I do. But at the end of the day, it really is just all for fun. We're just, we're just trying to have fun doing this and uh, I'm going to continue making videos and sharing them with you. So if you like what you see, I encourage you to smash that thumbs up button. And if you want to see more videos, you can click the box beside me in the link. And I really encourage you to subscribe and share so that we can build this base and, and get the word out about uh, what Old Car Auto really is. Guys, thanks again for watching and we will catch you in the next upload.